So today we'll be unboxing the new Apple Watch Series 6 product red edition as well as two new solo loop bands, which are very different in price. This one is actually two times the price of this. So we'll find out the difference today. So let's unbox the new Apple Watch. So the box actually has like all the red wordings here. As well as you can see the undertone of the box. Ta-da! It is red as well. Wow. Truly product red. Oh my god, I love this. And this is actually the first product red uh, Apple Watch that Apple is making. And as well as there's also a blue one, which is also the hero color of this year as well. For the new iPhone 12, which rumored to be the hero color is blue. Oh wow, oh my god. They are so detailed. Look at that, man. Wow. Oh my god. Even the wrapper here, it's like in red. Usually I'll just ditch this away, but this one feels like I want to keep it. I'm not sure if this is new for all the Apple Watch Series 6, but oh my god. Mm. This is like cardboard material. First time I'm seeing this. Ah, there. It's turned on. Lovely. Wow. So pretty. And what else are inside here? Let's see. Designed by Apple in California. Hmm. What's this red thing? Okay, this tells you that it's a product red. Okay, the usual stuff. Okay, let's just put, put this aside. Ah, ah. I was hoping this to be product red as well. <laughs> I was a bit excited for a while. The charger for the Apple Watch. Let's see whether is it USB-C or is it... Oh, this is actually USB Type A. That's all. And under that... Da, 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 and this is the sports band for the red product red edition. Okay, not any other red, but product red, okay? Okay. Ta -da. So this will be the product red Apple Watch band. This is the sports band. So for all sports bands from Apple, you will actually get two stripes. One is the shorter one and one is the longer one. So for me, I'm always the big wrist one. So I will be using the big one. Okay, yeah. Let's put it in. Oh. Let's see how it looks. So, mm, not bad, not bad, not bad. I wish that it can be a little bit darker, the red, but it's not too bad. When you wear the sports band for first timer, you probably will find it a bit clumsy and cumbersome to actually to wear it. But it's actually very easy. All you need to do is hold it like that, turn, then insert to the loop that you want. Okay. And then, ta -da! That's it. And it's tight and secure. Nice. That's product red, Apple Watch band. Okay. And here we have the solo loop bands. This is the deep navy solo loop. And this one will be Inverness green braided solo loop. So this braided one is actually 149 Singapore dollars. And this one is actually 69 Singapore dollars. So, yep, this one is really more expensive. And what makes the solo loop band so special is because they are very elastic. You do not need to use any claps like this to wear the band. All you need to do is basically stretch it open and then put it in. Mm -hmm. And the solo loop band actually comes in like nine sizes. Basically, you would have to go to the Apple website and they will give you guidance on how to get the right size for your wrist. And if you're really uncomfortable to do the measurement yourself, you could actually head down to a Apple store and they will be able to do the measurement for you. Okay, this is my Series 5 here and I love this combination that I had for this year's uh, Pride band. This one is the normal sports loop band and this is the Nike Pride loop bands. See the colors, the rainbow colors are actually hidden in the holes here. So I actually mix and match these two 
watch bands together and it's very nice come 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 let me show you oh and this is the new apple watch face that i actually customized to make it look like the rainbow here to have something new on the watch itself it's very pretty i really love this combination that i made but that means you have to buy two watch bands lah huh that's the fun of having an apple watch you can actually mix and match to make your style okay this is my series 5 so let me take up the old bands here and let's hope that my measurement work and uh, put this two together oh my god the material is actually very very soft it's actually harder on the regular sports bands and this one is like thinner and it's like oh my god so elastic Ooh, it's actually very comfortable it feels comfortable i mean i haven't wear it let's try it jung, jung. size 9 oh my god perfect fit Ta -da. this is also one of the new watch face as well Ta -da. this one this is the gmt watch face beautiful if you're a rolex fan you know you'll know what is this gmt watch face oh my god the fit is oh nice and snug man i mean not too loose and not too tight wow oh see so elastic cool 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 love it but i do not know that you know after a long term use would it like too stretchy and then it becomes like loosened a bit hopefully not ah but taking out is not so easy yeah just to quickly show you how i did my measurement to get the correct size for my watch band if you have a measuring tape like this at home make one loop and here i go see i have this one here and it says 18 cm so i actually key in into the website and it tells me that i'm a size 9. so when you measure yourself remember to make sure that it's a tight uh, measurement because 1 cm will make a lot of difference uh if i put 19 cm right it will be size 10 instead of a size 9 and now size 9 actually fits me perfectly so the measurement is actually quite accurate mm, i love it so now next we are going to open the braided solo loops this is the expensive one cham, cham. oh wow Ooh, the material is so different Okay, so this is, you know, a bit rubber, rubbery, right? So this one is a bit like your, a bit like your stretchy nylon ro ropes. Ooh, so pretty. Oh my God. And I love this color because if you have an iPhone 11, so this is the iPhone 11 Pro Max. And you see, this is the midnight green and it matches this band. My God. This is my Apple Watch Series 4 in stainless steel and check out, this is the band that was launched together with the Midnight Green last year. It's quite close, but this is even closer to the Midnight Green. My god, I love this one. I can't wait to try it on. Ta -da! Because both sides actually look pretty much the same. So in order to know that you are putting it on the correct side, so make sure that you check this side where you see that there's three black rubbers here and then the other side two rubber and then one without a rubber in the middle so make sure that when you put it in it should be the three black facing up okay and slot it in like that Ta -da! and like that see nice and snug oh my god oh my god love it so beautiful god Oh my, oh, perfect fit, perfect fit. Wow, look at that and that. So nice. Okay, the only issue here with this solo loop I have will be like, you know, taking out is a bit troublesome. Okay. And, but it's really, really pretty and it's really, really quite worth it. I love it. It's okay for that troublesome part. It's fine. I can live with that. So which are your favorites? The product red? The solo loop band? Or the braided solo loop bands? Uh, it's very difficult for me to choose. Mm, personally, my favorite would still be these two combined together. But I think my next favorite would be the new braided solo loops. It looks so well with my iPhone. My God! 
So if you have any questions for us, please leave it down in the comment section below. And if you like our video, remember to give us a thumbs up and share it with your friends, okay? See ya. Bye.